Shalom everyone. Today we are here in the presence of the Lord to meditate the word of God and to know about him even better. Uh, as a believers, we seek for the anointing. There are uh, many people in the Bible who were anointed to do the will of God, including Jesus. So as we see uh, in the chapter Luke chapter number 4 and verse number 18, the scripture says, the spirit of the Lord is on me because he has anointed me to proclaim good news to the poor. He has sent me to proclaim freedom for the prisoners and recovery of sight for the blind, to set the oppressed free, to proclaim the year of the Lord's favor. Here Jesus was anointed for the poor. He was not anointed for the rich. Jesus was anointed to uh, proclaim freedom for the prisoners. He was anointed to recovery of the sight of the blind and to heal the sick. So there are certain chosen people for his anointing. In the same way, we are all anointed for some reason. Our anointing is not for every person. As here, Jesus says that his anointing is to proclaim the uh, good news to the poor. Your anointing is for your chosen people. Here, the chosen people of Jesus are the one who are poor and not the rich. The chosen people of the Jesus are the one who are the prisoners and not the one who are free. So there are some few people who are for your anointing. They need your anointing to be free. They need your anointing to receive the gospel. So we are all anointed with some kind of will that is upon us. Our anointing is not for everyone. Our anointing is for certain people. Here Jesus was anointed for the poor. He knew that. Hence, he went after the poor. People in those days were keeping the sick away from their town. People in those days were ignoring the poor. But Jesus was anointed for the poor. Jesus was anointed to heal the sick. He was running after them because he knew who his people were. His people were the one who were sick. His people were the one who are poor. His people are the one who are oppressed. His people are the one who, who, have, who lack the freedom, who are uh, binded in, as a prisoners. Here Jesus knew who his people are. Hence he went after them to do the will of God. You might be anointed, but if you do not know what you are anointed for, you cannot uh, go after that purpose that God has given you. So as a believers, it is not only important to be anointed, but also important to know what your anointing is. Here Jesus knew his anointing, hence he went after the people who are chosen for him. Maybe you are anointed for the rich people and you are going after the people who are poor. Maybe you are anointed for the people who are old and you are going after the after people who are young to preach the gospel of the Lord. Know who your people are. As Jesus was anointed for the poor, when he preached the gospel to them, when he healed them, they received his healing. It is important for you to know who your chosen people are so that you could preach the gospel of the Lord and glorify his name and do his will. I hope you understood the word of the God. God bless you. Shalom.